Oh, hi there. If I said to the sovereign sitting over there, to my left, possibly to your right, if I said to the sovereign sitting over there, how are you? What do you think the sovereign would say? Hi. I know my head's cut off a little bit, isn't it? And then you have these books here, but you don't quite know what they are. Yeah, I'm thinking about this. I'm thinking about this and I'm doing something about it. How about something like that? How does that, how does that land? Oh, you can't see my head at all. Interesting. Interesting. But what if we put it behind this? What if we put it behind this candle? Mm -hmm. Now you could see me, right? Hi. Hi there. You seem a bit off kilter. Are you all right? Just gonna balance this ever so thoughtfully, you see. Hi. Hello. This is my halo. <laughs> How's it going? I'm just testing some new storytelling, you know. Some new storytelling techniques. Uh -huh. Interestingly enough, and um, you know, I'm just thinking about the placement of things and um, you know, it's very lonely being an artist. You just push and you push and you push. You push and you push and you push and it's amazing how these mentors, <laughs> it's amazing how these mentors, they're always on vacation, you know? I love them, but like, Somehow they're always on vacation. You know what I mean? I like, when do I get to go on vacation? Because this is not, hasn't exactly been a vacation. It's been like a work from home -ation? Obituation. Obituation. It's obituation. I'm writing people's... Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Oh, we see who's paying attention now, don't we? We see as I remake Citizen Kane. As I remake Citizen Kane, we see how the Godfather drives me. We see how the Godfather drives me. There's no, I'm not, I'm on, I'm not on the mic. I am just marking time. Can we give it up for um, Nicole Fleetwood? Uh -huh. You see, I'm, it's like I'm rocking myself, you see. I've just come across a fantastic new innovation that I must really co-credit my King Robert. Robert Reed Thrar. I must explain what it is that I want to do. 
Once again, we're back at this juncture. Thank you, Jonathan Flatley, if you're watching this. Thank you, Jonathan Flatley, for telling me to say what I mean. You know? You know, inside the actor's studio of my life, I really learned a lot of things and you know, I love just floating around, if I could put it like that, you know what I mean? I do feel like I'm getting very intimate with you in this, in this particular space. Yes, no, 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 don't worry, everything's under control, okay? What I'm doing is I'm introducing you to how to chill. Right, people, I remade, hi, I remade Days and Confused Part 2. Days and Confused No More, RRP, putting me through this. What is the similar situation exactly? Rubber Reed Far, I'm calling you. <laughs> And now, dear audience, I could just, could you imagine somebody then calling me back? Like we could stitch it together as a video. Oh, Richard Linklater style. Woo, declaration. I've got declaration money, honey. <laughs> and let me tell you something about Southern Nice. Nice Nasty? Let me tell you something about Nice Nasty. Ooh, I saw the Nice Nasty. Ooh, I saw that Nice Nasty. Woo! Did I see that Nice Nasty? Ooh! And now there's plausible deniability around it. Is that so? Is that so? that I've remade The Godfather through academia? I highly believe you catch my drift here. How does my hair look? Is it, is it, is it eyes wide shut enough for you? Why are people still wearing their masks? Why are people still, why are people still wearing masks? Pe if people are not, if people are wearing masks, that now means, attention, por favor, and todos las lenguas, si, las idiomas, si, por, uh, lo siento, los, las idiomas. Los idiomas, las idiomas. <laughs> es, un obra, es un obra en proceso, mi español. Sí, mi fluencia. Sí. Okay. Vale. So, you see, everything's coming up rosy. It seems to be a doge or a dog e. Tigo forty eight one triple zero twenty two twelve thirteen. 17. I like the chances of that at winning the table at 21. If I held there at a 17, if I held at a 17, I like my chances there very, very much because you would have to then risk at two cards. That's at one card. At two cards. At three cards, obviously. 
Yeah, I don't really... This, like... I don't quite know what to do with this basket. This eagles thing. But I'm gonna come up with something. I most certainly am. In my aesthetic education practice. But yeah, for now it's gonna stay outside here. really hard to read the situation sometimes, but that's what I'm doing here. Right? I've got my two rings on now. The serpent and the TJ. I've jettisoned that signet ring. That's all that UVA made, a signet ring. <sighs> over here right now, but like, what else? Do you know? I'm like, basically that's it. You know, I'm just doing my thing. Yeah, I made a lot of room in here for, for, you know. the next for my production phase, which is my vacation's over, people. That said, I stopped producing. I don't even know why I'm recording this. I mean, you know, for the making of documentary, of course, the making of the comeback remake. The making of the comeback remake. Yo. It's the comeback, hi! Hi, yes, no, it's me. It's me calling. Hi. How's it go? Fantastic. Yeah, no, it's in the, f you yeah, know, in the future where I am. Yeah, it's just, I just pick you up through my ears. Yeah, remember they put this, some of us elected to, remember some of us had those chips put into us? And then it turned out that they were, they were faulty and, but they couldn't be taken out. And then it turned out that they weren't functioning the way they were supposed to anyway. Because much like, well, let's just say not enough due diligence had been done. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I too wrote, for a declaration. The declaration at the University of Virginia. And I can tell you a story about the Declaration of Independence. Oh yes, I can. But it's top secret information. Because I've also remade Tinker Taller, soldier, spy, and Gary Oldman, it's a go. Baby, it's a go. Uh, oh, I love this scent from San Francisco. How do I explain? I'm also making a musical spring awakening. Spring awakening. 
spring awakening, spring awakening, spring awakening, spring awakening, spring awakening, spring awakening, spring awakening into my extrasensory perception, my ESP. Yeah. Yes, baby. I'm in my director's chair now. We all knew it was going to go here. And I'm narrating my life Fuck anybody else's narration of my life. And you know what? I'm sorry I'm white, but I'm also gay and queer. And basically trans at this point, okay? Listen, do, do you hear my voice? There's no gender in my voice. I've tried, you know, but it's just like Dawn is, but we're on a stakeout, you see. Yeah, there's, it's just sort of like this ever-evolving Russian doll situation. You know, I was thinking about the Trojan horse, but through the concept of the snake. I was thinking about snake oil as I was recording on my podcast yesterday. Snake oil. Right. Snake oil. Versus three-in-one oil. Is everybody getting this now? My innovative pedagogical work here. Yeah, this might be my pedagogical series. This one right here might be my pedagogical series. Maybe we'll call this pedagogical design, PD1. Yes, yeah, acting. What I prefer to think of as enacting, in particular, black enaction, because black people get shit done. They're the ones, along with indigenous and native peoples, brown people. They're the ones who are really out here changing the world. And I'm one of them now. Unfortunately, some white people have to come along too. I know it's horrible. It's absolutely horrible, but it's the truth. You know, look at John Brown to name one. Listen, from one Presidente to another, you know, from my spherical room to another, forget the Oval Office, that's one dimensional. Spherical, say it with me, spherical, 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 that's where we want to be, spherical. Yeah, so this is like my keeping room, and I keep here. You can think of it as anything you could possibly want to think of it as, in fact, because... Like, I'm not going to tell you, like, a different way of doing it, you know? But, uh, it's feeling pretty good in here, I have to say. It's feeling pretty good in here, I have to say. Things are coming along really nicely in this course. And, uh, you know... There's a lot of, there's a lot to think of with, with Tesla. 
I guess, uh, oh yeah. Yeah, I'm doing the, I'm doing the, I'm doing another Gilded Age. Another Gilded Age, Aga. Another Gilded Age remake, Agar. Agar. Dr. Toby. My biotechnology lab, senior year, Tom and in High School for Science and Technology in Alexandria, Virginia, where currently there's a debate over admissions policies, diversity and underrepresented black people. And lighter next people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And from my perch here in the anti sovereign corner. You see, I've rearranged things. You get different views of me now. And sitting here, I have different views, and this is exactly than I had before. It all started because this is actually an ongoing situation. You can't see it, but I can see my set now, and it's gorgeous. And it's perfectly set up for me. Well, this was always attributed to Field of Dreams. If you build it, they will come. And people, I built it. So we'll see if anybody comes now. That's what I would like to say to you, Robert, a version of that. Because it feels quite convivial in here. Even though it's also extremely chic. This is what a dilettante designer does. A DD. This is what a dilettante designer does. I'm gonna be sitting in that chair a lot more. So this uh, needs to be moved slightly this way. It's hard to get these things lined up exactly the way that you want, but you can certainly get close to it, my friends. You can certainly get close to it. And, um... Mm. We've got some really fantastic things in store, but we're not going to be
Yeah, you see, now people, now it's very comfortable for sitting because I can sit here and I can offer the couch to somebody, you see. But if I also wanted to do therapy, they could sit in this couch. You know what I mean? Like, that could also work. If I ever decided to go into therapy, you know, it's a possibility. Like I could figure out the right way to do it, but it would be like creative coaching. looking around that's design thinking right that's how you design Arthur taught me that yeah it's his birthday today happy birthday kiddo wherever you are but yeah now it's nice to visit here or I can offer somebody this this seat you know so, which is a very nice view but yes, the sovereigns there, I've turned them around. The light, the halo light, I turned them around. There's no more halo light here. It's just this, if you want to call that a halo light. Um, But yeah, I can see a lot here, and I'm calling these interstitials. Interstitials, these lost ones that I shot. Interstitials, interstitials, interstitials. Interstitials, interstitials, interstitials. That one takes a look. Great. So then we just put away these and then I'll be right back, okay, for a closing ceremony. Oh, gorgeous. Loving the love. I can't. Just design thinking, people, and redesigning. Those are the two things you ever have to do. It looks gorgeous in here. Oh, I'm so grateful. Oh, I'm so grateful.
Yeah, I'm doing film studies, but really performance studies, and I'm using it to um, become a performer myself, which is what has happened over the last year when I wanted just to boost my teaching skills, but I just became an all-around performer. Ta-da! So, thanks very much for joining me on this interstitial reel, this interstitial journey. I think I have maybe three interstitials now. They're not being publicized, so they're just going to be interstitials, and they're just more um, proof-of-concept tapes, and I wasn't really trying to go for anything in particular. Just more to see how it looked, and then I might as well just put it out there. And it looks great, right? This looks this looks fantastic as a set, right? You see what's going on? You catch my drift, my driftwood. I'm putting together a concentric Russian doll experience. Yeah, I'm just cutting it in different. I'm I'm reframe. I'm framing it in different ways and doing it in different ways. It's the legitimately transdisciplinary method. TM. Transdisciplinary method, TM. And that'll be in um, my upcoming book project, my third, the third in a trilogy, Original Gangsters, Speculation, and then In the Make. Came up with it. Thanks, everybody. Ciao for now.